Hello YouTube, welcome back to Learning Life and Loving Radio Scanners. My name is your host, Tommy Cunningham. In today's video, what we are planning to talk a little bit about is like, what is my opinion on either DMR communication or listening to regular analog communication with the Baofeng DM1701? Now, now you guys are probably wondering, now tell us, Tommy. Now, which areas are you planning like to take your radio scanner to and try it out? Because there's like lots of destinations that probably won't let you. So they got like escort details, they got tickets, they also got 13 areas on there. Now, now, they also go go back to Kentucky. Now, Kentucky has a lot of different stuff that uses DMR there, which I think is really kind of cool. Now, now, they also got a world famous casino there, which not a lot of people know about, which I'm kind of surprised on. And this casino is like a really good, it's a casino that where, where I'm waiting to check out. It's called the Oak Valley Casino Resort. And honestly, I think they got some different communication options down there in Tennessee. Now, because down there in Tennessee, you guys got like, for instance, like Montgomery County, which also Stork County also got a little bit of interesting stuff. Like for instance, they got Fort Campbell. They also got the UM Matrix. They also go over if we go to Montgomery County, they got on here. They got like Bridge Mount. They also got uh, Tennessee Homeland Security, which I would honestly thought that Tennessee Homeland Security would automatically communicate with the other one, but it doesn't, which I think is really kind of weird. Now, like also, Now, like, also, there is some communication that I can listen to, like, whenever I go on the road, like, to, let's just say, Switzerland County, because they got a couple of DMR radio frequencies there. And, like, also, they use a lot of DMR communication, like, whenever you guys go over there, to like casino boats, if you guys go over there to like that kind of stuff. Because they need areas that need a secure connection. Which honestly, I think that that would be really kind of awesome if they could get that in motion. Like if everything goes, goes like by that quick. But honestly, to let you guys know, anything that goes by that quick has to go by through a traditional radio sequence. So, so let's just say there is like a big disaster coming up. Like, like everybody, not, Kind of like everybody is planning to look for a new job and everybody thinks that, it, I'm just saying this, don't everybody think it. Now, now then after that, we think about our different possibilities. Like our first possibility is 
At number one, they open up a mega hotel that everybody could pay rent out. And, and then after that, whenever they pay rent, they could probably use that place and go look around like at the different communication that they got, which I think would be really kind of cool. Now, also, you guys got two possibilities on there, okay? So the first possibility is you guys take all your money and you guys take everything that goes inside a big luxury hotel, like for instance, French Lake Resort or West Bain Springs, and you guys divert that up to the new radio communication that everybody loves. Now, now also, now also you guys got several different like choices and stuff of entertainment. Like for instance, they got their own water park there. They also got their own dome you guys can go check out. Now Louisville's the same, but you guys got to drive a little bit further on there, which I think is really kind of awkward, is really kind of neat. Now then after that, you guys got like a couple, a couple of like positions that needs to be monitored. Like for instance, like security, like also, also like different radio robotics. You guys also need to make sure that the different people that goes by and, and, and goes by like several different words, like for instance, like if a person puts an or in like for, for like using like different radio communication and that stuff, like, like saying that work has radios and they don't even use it. Like for instance, like Sam's Club, they use radios there like sometimes. I've seen those radios behind their desk which I think is really kind of awkward. Now, 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 if you guys go like over there to the, let's just say Lowe's, Lowe's uses all their communication by using a phone. That right there is like so unpredictable and like so not reliable communication. And that's a thing that I think is so kind of weak. Plus like also checking out like different radio stuff like from like all around. You guys got so much more like different dispatches and stuff, which I think would be really kind of neat and like looking great on. So I, so I hope, I hope you guys are having a wonderful, a wonderful Labor Day. Um, so like also to talk about a little bit more on this, we are planning to take this a little further in depth, like talking about different radio frequencies and stuff, like whenever we go further on this subject. Now also, now also you guys got like several different areas that you guys got to listen to. Like you guys got to listen to sometimes security force. You guys also got to listen to EMT and a lot of that. All right guys, that's, uh, I'm just, um, today's video is brought to you by FrenchLake.com. FrenchLake.com is your next source for French Lake Resort in French Lake, Indiana. Have a great day, and I will see you guys tomorrow.
Remember to always be happy in YouTube. I will see you guys back in my next video.